the beast as punishment for our sins. We Did you get all that? Our ancient traditions. Baseness reigns where virtue once ruled. Breed and lust. Ah, let's put the tourney behind us. Hey, kid. Hi. What's up, Bark? Thank you. Welcome back yourselves. Oh, it can mean many, many things. Why aren't you playing Kingdom Come? We shall long bear the scars of that witch's visit. Are you playing Kingdom Come? Ah. All right, we gotta pick something better for our next quest. Yeah, Bark, are you playing Deliverance? <sighs> what do you think? Are you good? Father knows worst. Just take it from the top. Woof. One day, while strolling through Beauclair's bustling streets, Geralt spotted a notice. Someone was in need of an escort they wished to penetrate a cave. Task seemed none too complicated or taxing, so the Witcher concluded it would be unwise to let it pass. West to the west. Hmm. Wanna go fish in the channel? Doesn't sound half bad. You want to go fish in the channel? <laughs> We're never going to get away from this tourney. Double back on our steps. That's okay. Hmm. Keep calm. Start no problems. The last cries of the barrel lady. Ah, oh, so much better already. <clears throat> well, Bark, what do you like about Kingdom Come? I hear the combat is rather complicated at first. Would you agree it's a bit complicated? Panther? Panther. The 
the panther is not going for the deer. I don't get the people who say they don't like combat in this game. I don't get it. How could you not like that? Not the cave we were supposed to begin at? We're supposed to be escorting someone. Letter from Jacquette to Francois. Letter from Francois to Jacquette. My darling Francois, already a week has passed since my eyes last behold your, behold your fair visage, my beloved. I know important nightly matters keep you, yet pray tell, my sweet, how you can bear the horrible agony of our separation. Mama asks every day when you shall next pay us a visit, and Papa says he simply cannot wait until you at last kneel before him and ask for my hand. I explain to him how horribly busy you are, but in truth I too desire with all my heart and strength to see you kneel so and tell you at long last, yes, a thousand times, yes, yours always and forever, Jacquette. Dear Jacquette, I've thought and thought and finally have it. In order to fully deserve you, I must first prove to myself I am worthy of the tremendous honor of winning your hand. Know that I have sworn a chivalric vow not to rest till I bring you on a silver platter the head of Gratore, the hideous monstrosity which none so far has bested. Do not seek to find me, but instead watch for my glorious return as a proven monster slayer. Very respectfully yours, Francois. Wake up! <clears throat> oh, you scared me half to death, Drifter. What do they call you? What's your crest? Speak! Ravix of Forehorn. 
My crest shows a maiden sitting astride a striding bear. So, now that we've had our night-to-night -night chat, Francois Le Goff, I presume. Your betrothed sent me. See, you've been gone a while, so you've got her worried. I... well, indeed, for... for... Bertore is a most fearsome beast. I must prepare properly for battle. Mm, by napping outside the cave for a fortnight? I have tarried a bit, true, but the delay is done. My word I gave, thus the beast shall die. Wouldn't happen to need any help, would you? I... I don't know. After all, I did swear a solemn oath to... Deposit the beast's head at your beloved's feet. No mention of you killing it all by yourself, though. Head shall be yours, sir. I suppose you're right. We must fight side by side, then. For honor. For the glory of mankind. He's a quick one. But I shall be the one to lop off its head. Right by me. As long as it doesn't lop off yours Strange. first. No sign of Gratori. Perhaps we should turn back? If there's no beast, there's no beast. Damn shame, but we tried. Not so fast. Let's take a look around. Impressive. You'd think you were in a winter garden. Craft a potion. Be the bestiary about Gratori. Is Gratori? Oh, we have a Oh, uh, they just said it's brigand. Not cursed. Torre. <clears throat> Happened like this. A nasty rain caught me while I was out in the woods, so I thought to myself, I'll hide in some hollow, for God's forbid I get soaked through and catch a cold at my age. So I crawled into a cave, and there inside, something roars at me. Tore out of there so fast, wind had dried my coat by the time I got home. Bellis Stale, the herbalist. No one knows exactly when the Spriggan called Gratore first made its home in the caves at the foot of Mount Gorgon. Spriggans usually prefer isolated backwoods and rarely make dens in caverns. Yet Gratore seemed to have taken a liking to grottos, giving rise to its nickname. The monster was quite well known among Beauclair knights, who often talked of it as a potential source of great glory. None were particularly eager to actually engage the monster in combat, however. None, that is, except for the young knight, Francois. 
Matthew, what is this place? What is this place? The cave or the land? The land is Toussaint. This is the DLC, the Blood and Wine DLC. So the land is Toussaint. Fiends. Wouldn't like fiends. At Meridium, Relic Oil, Igni. <clears throat> Relic Oil is our weakest one. We have not been able to upgrade it yet. We need a cave troll liver. You meant this cave. West, side quest, northwest of the palace, an escort quest, called Feet as Cold as Ice. Lure out Gratoria by setting fire the plants. You played the DLC. You didn't recognize the cave. I got you, Matthew. I wasn't uh, wasn't sure what you were referring to. Did you hear the screams? Geralt, you set yourself on fire! Cool. I don't remember this either, Matthew. gonna be great what are we 36 37 I think 40 or 45 either way I just stepped in it uh, ads we should definitely take out the plants ah uh, okay Whoa. Welcome to Amateur Hour. Yeah, thanks. Okay. It's messy as heck. Hopefully our um, our buddy will take some of the aggro because it's gonna be nasty. Free crack giveaway. <clears throat> Do you see what we're working with now? This could be interesting. Really interesting. He's 
gonna pop up all over. is that plant or is it invincible while he's alive it might be invincible oh it is not but he just spawned another one that's not good I guess we shouldn't focus on the plants then after all but that's gonna be I feel about that. Don't stand in the fire, Gerald. a one two the spit came in right as he broke one of them broke the quen and one of them was the kill but they came in at the same time i don't know what the flower did electrocuted me i don't even know that's a high pressure fight it does not it, it, there's no room to breathe But you saw how pointless it was killing that plant. It took it took a lot of effort to avoid him long enough to take the plant down, which was not quick, even with that awesome whirl in the middle. And then he respawned it 10 seconds after it died. So avoid the plant. Golden Oriole would mitigate poison damage but as you saw, it wasn't the poison damage that killed us. It was getting hit while Quen was down. It really all happened in one. Mmm! Nasty fight. <clears throat> and our relic oil is off 10%. 10%. Now, Igni, if I could stay up long enough, build up some stamina, adrenaline, and maybe melee is not the best way to go. <clears throat> if I could 
catch him on fire. Maybe the ticks will be... That gives me a thought. Gotta look at something on her sword, too. I think the sword we're using right now has a decent burn chance. Hey, hero, please, just for a minute. Bleed, bleed, bleed. No, it does not have burn. It does not have burn. Do you have a sword with a good burn chance? Not on us. Okay. There it is. Uh, bombs? Grapno, fire damage. Dancing star, fire explosion, fire damage. A lot of fire damage. But I think we can... Let's just see if that works. Lure in a place where the plant can't shoot you. Plant can move around, so the plant drops those spores on the ground, right? And then can switch spots and pop up. But that basic idea, that makes sense. I have to juggle Quen just because one hit kills. And my sword's not gonna set him on fire, so let's say we did say what he's weak against Igni, yeah, Dimeridium Bomb. Which, I don't know, we might have Dimeridium Bomb if I go in and equip it. But I guess if we stood over here where the plant can't hit us as well, I tried to fight him over here a little bit. Timing was awful there. I gotta get used to his spawn, because it's pretty quick when he pops up. And I need to be able to avoid getting hit by him pops out of the ground right next to me. He is a lot like Alesha, though. You were right. He's in the corner. Got it. Torch. It's because I have the torch out. Shit. Oh, that was well played. So what happens when he's on fire? He freaks out a little bit. That's assuming the bomb even really worked on him, which I'm not sure it did. Just tickled him a little bit, yeah. I do rather wish my sword had a... a flame effect right now. Matthew, I think you were onto something, though. This is a better spot, and the plant... While the plant can move, you can see that the plant has not done a lot of moving so far. I gotta get back out here where the plant is. So it's spores. When it cast its spores up here, that became a problem for a minute. Ah. Is that? I think you were on to something, and I'm gonna try to stick with it. Ah! This is bad. Weird that it's letting us. Hey! Kite up into the. Hey! Goku just went down. Oh, such a clusterfuck. Can 
we pull him? Yeah, all the way out into the hall here. Didn't save our buddy. All right, when he's down, he's gonna have roots pop up around his body. I was really slow to recognize that. It's consistent, it seems every time that he goes down on his knees and does his thing. That one, he's gonna have roots pop up around his body. Or maybe it's another spot. But if I hit him when he's down, the roots should pop up right where I am, right? Which is right where he is. He's standing in the poison. Geralt, no! got hung up on the the flower the wall I got stuck in the hmm only spawn on water I don't think I don't know about only spawn on water maybe that maybe hmm let's try dragging him into the hall like a choke point see if I can Dodge more, but control the fight in the choke point. And those, we gotta, ah! We gotta break those fast. When they show up, he doesn't want to come all the way into the hall. But he will. So much projectile bullshit, too. Ah! I said. I'm trying to get stamina in Quen, which is why the projectiles are problematic. Wasted adrenaline. I think we, in we interrupted whatever he was doing. Only 10%. Yeah, relic oil. Nice timing. Nice timing.
Um, our relic oil is our only crappy oil left. We got Leshen resin off the spriggan, so definitely a Leshen relative. <laughs> Evo! Hey! Cannot save. You're unable to protect Francois. Was that his name, Francois? Return to Francois's beloved. Unfortunately, Francois didn't make it. All our oils, which are axed, we have two which aren't. Ogroid, relict. We need cave troll liver, and then we should be able to take relict up. <sighs> now the flowers have burned out. Lamia, how are you doing? Yeah, really good timing there. nothing to bring back from Francois's body. No, no ring, no sword. Oh, and he went completely spread eagle too. Spread eagled in death for your amusement. Hey, let me, did you start playing Witcher today? Thinking maybe you did. I wonder, can you even keep him alive? Anyone know? Can he live through the fight? <laughs> Got a game this morning. I know which one. Real world won't see you for a long time. Okay, this isn't the real world here. We're fine. Tucson, the land of blood and wine and roach. Roach will be roach. Go, go. Seven, hello. Go, roach, go. Go. Anywhere, anywhere will do, roach. Climb that hill. Show us what you're made of. There we go. That's what you can't do during the race. And I always forget roach can do it all. Roach can steer. Uh, sort of, sort of. Roach can sort of steer. Sometimes. A little bit. Did you know that peacocks go meow? They do. <laughs> Roach, please. So, who are we bringing the bad news to? 
S7, I bet you know. Francois just died fighting the Spriggan, the Leshen's cousin, the Spriggan. Can Francois survive that fight? You kill the Spriggan quickly enough? Or does he die? Guaranteed. All right, Roach, I'm sorry. This is not working out. Maybe next time, Roach. Maybe next time. Is that Goliath? Is that Goliath's head? I didn't realize Goliath's head was on our saddle. Rotore, not Goliath. Uh, still. There's Goliath. Yep, that's the guy. I had a feeling you might know. Well, the question is, is it even possible for him to survive? Yes, he's dead. D-E-D -E kind. Can he live? Is that a thing? It is. Honestly, we're lucky to have lived. That one is 45, we are 36. So we were, we were in a little over our heads there. It was intense. We, had, we just had to drag the Spriggan into the hall to avoid all the Arcaspore ads. It was out of control. And Matthew, thank you again for suggesting that. I was skeptical. I thought the way the Arcaspores move around, we would not be able to escape their line of fire. That, that worked. Save the day! Oh. And, uh... While, while we're talking about quests, I did the smitten... I did Fabio's quest at the tourney this time. Remember, I noped out. We should have noped out again. That was an awful quest. It ended. Oh, it ended well. The curse was cool. Vivian was cool. But 90 minutes lead time on getting to that part of the quest. Uh uh. Not gonna do that again. Sir, do you think Tucson is the prettiest city the in the game? Must be a terribly barbaric land. In an exaggerated fairy tale way, yes. Otherwise, I like the more earthy places. Fabio and the Bird Woman. Bird Woman, 10 out of 10. Fabio, I, I shall not abide. Never again. I would rather eat cardboard than do that quest again. Afraid I've got bad news. Sir Lagoff fell in combat. Oh, just as I had feared. He was so terribly courageous, bold to the point of being rash. He'd have done anything for me. Gran always said true love must end in true tragedy. It seems she was right. <sighs> Sorry we couldn't save him. I should go. Sorry for your loss. Not gonna take her money. Alright. Money's not a problem at the moment. Until the tax collector comes around and takes it all. We're good. We're sitting on 18,000 crowns. We've got nothing to spend it on. Not really. The blowout colors. So, even with the blowout colors, but they need to leave their homes unlocked. 
I just want a hunk of bread. Like that. One false move and you will regret it. Hand over the bread or you will regret it. Hand over the bread. Now. That wasn't clear? Ow! Where'd the bread go? Where'd the bread go? Ah! One false move and you will be rich. Ah! What are you doing? Damn good question. What are we doing? <laughs> had a scabbard. So now I'm worried about Wine Wars. Because Wine Wars is the other quest I've been told I shouldn't have noped out of because it's actually worthwhile if you go through the whole thing and put up with the whiny NPCs who are out to backstab each other into eternity. But after doing the tournament, I'm skeptical! How worth it can it be to listen to a couple whiny NPCs backstab each other into eternity? Something else. Father knows worst. One day, while strolling through Beauclair's bustling streets, Geralt spotted a notice. Someone was in need of it. That's how we ran into the night. We were going to do that, and we ran into Francois sleeping. That's what happened. We we're already doing this. Let's fast travel... Uh, out to the palace. No, just swim across. That would make a difference. Northwest. Wine wars. Decent. Detecting. Combat. Totally worth it at the end. Would you have said that about the tourney, though? How are you, Kessa? Message coming in. But that, I mean, that's that sounds promising. Misbehave with the host. I know you were streaming this morning. Today. Hey, thank you for the host and welcome. Dance, Witcher, dance. I dare say, Misbehave, you got here for the good parts. And the only thing you missed, just about, just about, was the tourney. And I was getting really salty in the tourney. Thank you for the host. Welcome. Viewers getting here with Misbehave. They're new here. I'm Jay. We're playing Witcher. Everybody, if you don't know Misbehave, you should. Please check her out on Twitch. There's a link. Some Jay Love, drop her a follow. How are you doing today? Trying to win the tournament. Yeah. Uh, that that fell apart quickly. The trying to win the tournament part. And I decided to settle for tournament being over as quickly as possible part. Like I want to enter into the should have fast traveled. Now I'm trying to get down to the water so I can swim away from the palace. Uh, Matthew, have you already tried refreshing? Hey, Seal. You joined, but where's the break? Where's the break? Oh! Pretty sure we just broke something. A leg, maybe? Our first break was especially late today. Probably take another one in 45 minutes. Ah! Misbehave. I bet it was not. I bet it was awesome. Must have felt kind of good. Must have felt kind of good. Should have... I didn't know you were streaming. Was it, uh, was it a short one? 
guess we've been going a few hours already here. Ten feet, didn't die. It's a good day. Greetings. Greetings. Well, good on you to do the stream. Anyways. Storm, damn it. Hey, Roach. <laughs> we rode, I rode us in the wrong direction. <laughs> Is just flowing out of that rock, huh? Roach, please. Come on, Roach. Let's go. Roach. A little talk here. Roach. gonna run I'm getting off before something something happens all right see you later Roach how's the delay now Matthew right it's much better Two minutes is no good. Uh, what event have the other day? Was it seven minutes? Five minutes? Seven minutes? I don't know why it would ever be that bad. You sound a little out of breath. What's this about? Monsters! Monsters there in the cave! We managed to flee, but Hugo remains inside! Not Hugo! Hugo. Our brother! He's still in there, inside! Help us find him! We'll pay you for your toil! Right. Well. You post that notice about an escort? Yes, we did. And not without cause, it seems. We waited some days, yet when none answered, we risked the expedition unaccompanied. Fools we were. We'd mm -hmm. have done better to show patience. Wait. Mm -hmm. Poor Hugo. Left to an unknown fate. Noticed what attacked you? There was no time. We ran for the exit as soon as we felt the earth quiver. But Hugo, well, he went the other way. So, monsters crawl out of the ground? I... I suppose... In truth, I don't know. We just ran. Did not look back. Why do you even go in there? We... lost our way. Hmm. Mistake that cave for the high road? By the hair on my chinny chin chin, what difference does it make whether we went in for a stroll or to gather students? Hugo remains inside, in grave danger. That's what matters. Will you go in after him or not? Every second could be vital. I like all the cheeky fairy tale stuff, but overall, I think the writing in Hearts of Stone better than the writing in Blood and Wine. Not universally true, but... 
Fine. Anyways. I'll look for him. You two stay out here. By the hair on my chinny chin chin. Little pig, little pig, let me in. Think so, evil. What can good i think the blood spray was extra there i mean i don't think we were actually near death for some reason the blood tinge near that why is the blood tinge from the kicky moors are they applying a bleed effect because usually you don't see that much blood around the edge of the screen until you're near death which okay we're not in great shape but we're not, we weren't near death that's why we're toxic now because i'm a little confused by the extra blood spray Oh no, you've gone from the frog song to green jello. You got the reference though. It was green jello. I have the original CD, not green jelly. I, ha I have the green jello CD somewhere. I might have got it from Columbia House. Uh, you know what I mean, Columbia House. Come on, if you know green jello, then you know Columbia House. This is a mess. I don't want to be toxic. I don't want to die. I want to live. feeling a little sickly. Actually, doesn't look too bad. Girl? Considering you're, you're, you're tripping balls, you don't look half bad. Look for signs. Oh, how's the statue? Don't forget to cup the bowls. Um, I think the statue's fine. We should go back for our 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 free stroke, right? We were promised a, a free stroke. Something like that. Hmm. <clears throat> Really? Columbia House, Mail Order, CD, Club. Get seven CDs for just a penny, and then we will charge you every month. Then you can pay $20 a CD. Weapon was Hugo's, maybe. Make up the difference. Blood trail. Could be Hugo's wounded. Blood hasn't even dried. Stand to refresh everything. Warm and 
damp. Kiki Moors prefer cooler environments. Probably why they keep their distance. Or blood. Else. Damn, water's hot. Get burned if I don't watch it. Could use some protection. Maybe Quen will work. I think. Quen as protection against hot water. New one on me. Put points into Igni this time. We are burning fools left and right. When we're off, our health is probably ticking down, but you know, details. Geralt, what do you think? You wanna you wanna live? You wanna leave? We are dying. See the we are get out of the water, girl! How close to death do you think we are? That close. Hmm. See, that's the kind of red we were seeing when the Kikimors were taking a single bite. Swipe. It looked like we were near death. That's my cue for you're screwed, take swallow. But it wasn't what was going on. So I wasted Swallow and got us all toxic right at the beginning of the fight. Well, Swum, Master Witcher. You should have seen me going after Shawnee's shoe. Now that was some swimming. Blood has Wrong way. Died. We got turned around. We get everything we need from the cave. You, Hugo, your brother sent me. Ja, desserts, scoundrels, tartmongers. They attacked me, but I vented them off. Now, they sent a brigand to finish the job. No. What are you talking about? Ran into them outside, claimed monsters attacked. They ran, made it out, but you got stuck inside. They asked me to help you. Is that what they told you? The lying weasels. More trickery on their part, I'm certain. Whoa, slow down. What's this about? Uh, I'm Hugo Monar. My father, Victor Monar, you may have heard of. A cognac distiller he was, famed for it. Before he passed, my brothers and I would quarrel over who would inherit the family business. So father decided he would force us to work together. He broke his still down into its parts. Three of them he hid, telling each of us the location of one. When my brothers learned my part, the last, was hidden in here. They decided they did not need me anymore. They decided to cut me out of the business, literally. We argued, fought. The noise must have woken the beasts. My brothers ran for the mouth, while I ran deeper in. Oh, I'll stick my nose into this one. Hmm. So you came here to find a piece of a still. I mean this thing? Yes! Where did you find it? Bottom of the pool of a hot spring. Got a knack for these things. Your, your pay. It is not much, I know. But I promise you good prices. The best thing once the tavern is open again. Hold you to that. Now let's go. Brothers are probably getting antsy. Wait, see there? My brothers. They've rounded up some thugs. They mean to attack me. We don't know that. 
Would you try to tell me it's a coincidence that they return with an arm? Looks man. bad, Hugo, but it's They've okay to find out first. Part of the still. They won't kill me for it. Please, you my only hope. Kill them. Elsewise, they'll kill me. Kill your brothers? You want that? Well, perhaps not them, but the other roughs, for certain. As to my brothers, I don't know. You couldn't perhaps render them harmless? Uh, will you defend me? There's a difference between defending and attacking. I'll make sure you're not hurt. If I remember right. And I don't remember much. I defended him and then it's not what it appears. Because nothing ever is. The owls are not what they seem. No one dies, not today. Geralt, that would be some serious bullshit right there. Heads roll every day. Don't even go there. <sighs> Don't have much of a choice. Thanks. A thousand thanks. I shall wait here. What are you doing? Well, for starters, decency. He's gone mad. No, see, they're, already, they're, they're coming in with swords drawn, whether you can't put your sword away and stop them. Oh, now that's some bullshit. Trails, sir. I thought I might loot them. Fucking archers, crossbows. Jeez. You guys are gonna burn. No, 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 no. You guys are gonna fucking burn. Told you. Oh, do you think that's funny? That fucking bow you've got there? Told you you were gonna burn. Oh, the time! Oh! What a bouncer. Hats off to you. Well earned. Well played. My lust for killing crossbows and bowmen was too great. Too great. Ah, uh, Witcher! What uh, are you doing? Witcher! You do some decency. He's gone mad. Archers. Serpentine! 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 Fuck you! Serpentine! see him burn I don't want to play defensively I want to set them all on fire what would be kind of cool is if what if you had limb specific uh, what if you had limb specific burning 
What if you could set someone's arm or separately their head on fire? And what if it wasn't always just full body? Wouldn't that be great if someone's hair could... I mean, you could set someone on fire! But not necessarily... Um, conflagration, just... You know... A little bit. These cr the crossbows have really got to die. There is a reason for it. It's not just that I hate them. It's that they will screw up the combat for the rest of the fight if we don't get them out of the way. I don't really want to just lure them into the cave one by one because it would be a little silly. I've got this choke point. And I can get out of it. I guess we should just get out of it, huh? Why did I go back in? Here, let me put myself back in this awesome choke point you had me in. I guess out here we're just... The archers have a... Easy shot at us. Release the bombs. We actually do have bombs this time. This is a good idea. Even better, the bombs... The bombs continue to burn people when we attack them with swords. Which I learned recently that Igni, we will interrupt Igni with physical damage from our sword, but we won't interrupt uh, the bombs. We can attack through the bombs. And you will keep burning! Is still an archer and they are still dicks. There's the archer. Shit. I think he bled out. We have a pretty strong bleed from our fa fast attacks right now. So, Hugo. I, for one, do not believe it. They Boom. were overcome with greed, ready to do anything to wrest the last part of the still from me. Besides, you did not kill them. They will come too, soon, having learned a valuable lesson, I trust. <sighs> so, Hugo. So what now? Uh, I fear I don't know. I can't possibly hope to rebuild my father's still. I suppose I must hang a shingle in the market, sell wine. Or perhaps I should move on, leave Toussaint. Alas, I know not and will have to see. Whatever the case, I shall not forget your help. That was pretty awesome. Boom. He did a full flip, right? Didn't he go down like face down and then go feet overhead? End up on his back. So long, Hugo. So long. Off time we went our separate ways. Good luck, whatever you decide to do. I thank you, Witcher. Fare thee well. Seeing you. Did not fight well, but that was a gnarly group. Starts at a choke point. They got you 50 yards away. Three archers. That's how you take someone down. But you take a witcher down. I come charging out here and. Girl, why did. Something wrong, girl? You don't want to run? Oh, we're overweight. We've crossed the line. 
let's go sell, clean up a little bit, take a break, and then, uh, and then we'll go a couple more hours. But I want to, we've got to clean up. Got to have weight, but no value. Doesn't matter. We got plenty of coin. All this stuff around us, though. We need to sell. Need to sell. Palace Gardens. Then we'll hop over. Where are we going to sell? And we should hit up our stash. Level 37 is incoming soon we'll be able to pull iris out of the stash we haven't been able to take her for a spin yet i'm blind the stash is here somewhere right a couple quests we haven't picked up where's the stash oh corvo bianco we need uh we need a merchant more than we need stash Sell your die to the armor for max bucks. Talk about found money. Yeah, but we got 18,000 crowns I can't really spend right now anyways. In fact, keeping things like die and instead of doing currency exchange with Vimy, hanging on to it so that after I get robbed by a guard somewhere, which you're picking a fight, then we can sell and Reclaim some of our lost wealth. Hmm. <sighs> Eat the view. so short but so sweet for five seconds that was blissful can i have it back oh. the music the sun the harpies the the art the the blades the <sighs> all right we get another go are we half dead or something no just hit hard. We lost the music. Yes! Matthew. The one K. You know when you crossed?
They hit harder than those Kikimores. Even the big one? They hit harder than... Those bandits? Nasty. Too bad a Witcher can't have two signs equipped. See, what, look at how much damage they did with like one hit. One stuff. So, two hits and dead. One hit, whoomp. Two hits, dead. Level, we are 36. Level 45s we were fighting a few minutes ago. They were not doing that much damage, so. What do you think? What level could they be? I will get wrecked. Us, we get wrecked. They live. Maybe we should fight with that view in the background. How about that? And the finish off. You, you see the finish off prompts? I don't know why I have so much trouble with them. When they're lying on the ground after being stunned, there. It's a single tap of X. It's not a complicated maneuver. But you have to not be button spamming and attacking something else. And it doesn't always come together. But I think that's the way to take them out here because they aren't dying very quickly with regular attacks and they're killing me in two hits. one of the most beautiful places you could have a fight with winged creatures or what look at the backdrop That's why we play games. <sighs> 
Wow. Wow, Bob. Wow. Ring of fire. Ring of fire. Take one witcher and that scenery to go, please. Yeah. We just stay here. It's, uh, that might be all right. Well spent time. Are we even going somewhere? Maybe. Maybe not. Ooh, no. Yeah, it's a good spot for our next break, but let's figure out where we're going. We were gonna sell. That's where we were going. What DLC? Uh, misbehave? Blood and wine? Or was the question for us? Oh, we can't leave yet. We're right next to something. Southwest of us? What's there? It's just kidding. I'm pretty slow. Sonic, how are you doing? Did I just punch that bear uphill? Oh man, girl, you're a fucking tank today. Dig it back. Discovered location? Not quite. What did we not discover that's right here?
right, I'm bringing up the mini map for a second. I hate chasing a, a single question mark. It's probably an underground thing, cave, whatever. You see how it's not right where the question mark is. We need to do some repairs. We definitely need to sell. Finally, there's some of the harpy loot. Find cave entrance down here. We're at our weight capacity. We pick up one more sword and we're over, so we really do need to fast travel, sell, repair the works. It is time for a break. So let's combine those things. That's what I was trying to do. Got wonderfully sidetracked as happens in The Witcher. Back to the palace gardens. torch. Yeah. Witcher's known for starting forest fires. interest in Geralt. Did you hear the boar? Come on! You're my brothers! What's up? Maybe. I think there was a ward somewhere in the pack. sell how much cash the merchants here carry see we never even picked up some of the quests back in town let's see Matina gate Death. armorer herbalist let's see if we can't pick up some alcohol sell some of the stuff we need to sell then break then break down mini map for a second here I don't I don't know my way around at all um main street though we're just going main street take the left fork and then we should have the smith on the right and the armorer dead ahead all right I, I could do that long live duchess Anna Henrietta like that probably has oh, no oh, the Smith is in there somewhere. 
Greetings. A witcher from the school of the wolf. School of the wolf. In, in the flesh. I'm Lazar Lafarque. Geralt of Rivia. Seem pretty enthused. Got a job for me? Rather. Mind you, it's no monster hunt, but I'm sure you'll be interested all the same. I'm an armorer, see, and I for years sought diagrams for which armor of exceptional quality. Grandmaster. Give out the master, master, master quest. Heard of them. Never seen any, though. Thought they were lost. Not quite. For I've been lucky enough to learn that their holders came to Tucson. Alas, they then perished, but I know where. I just need a partner to help me retrieve them. If you know where to look, why not get them yourself? No offense, but do I look like a rough-hewn adventurer? Besides, who would serve my clients while I romped about seeking them? No, I'd rather leave it to someone familiar with such matters. Bring me the diagrams, and from them I'll forge for you whatever you fancy. What do you have on offer? He's got cash. Give me the cash! This is good. What are we keeping? We'll keep our special armor, but it's going in the stash. They didn't expect me to wear it, do you? Night boots. <laughs> night boots, the night gauntlets. The night trousers, I'll keep those too. So the die, you're saying the die is worth a lot. <laughs> worth a lot. Well, we're keeping that. Dahlia. Dahlia. Adversary. Twenty-three thousand crowns. Yeah, a break. But you, do you need a break? I bet somebody out there needs a break. I can't be the only one who needs a break. All right. somehow wound up in Tucson? How is that even possible? Mm. Tusa was once home to Tien Said, a legendary and now deceased elfin master armorer. Witches from all corners of the world came to him to forge their plate, their mail. Heard about him. Supposed to have been the best. And thus he charged the king's ransom for his work. Witches would take difficult dangerous work to earn the coin to pay him. Some, uh, alas, met with misfortune, and the diagrams they carried were left to rot with their earthly remains. Got it. Find them, find the diagrams. But how can I know where to look for their remains? As it happens, I learned my trade at Jensai's side. So I heard the stories of the missing witches first hand. What he told me, well, that is what discouraged me from seeking the diagrams out myself. We must strike a deal. I shall tell you all I know. In return, once you found the diagrams, you will let me draft a copy. This elven master. Why is everyone in Tucson so tiresome? Human for an apprentice. 
My father forged armor. As a youngster, I helped him, then began forging my own pieces. Master Tian Sail saw my work and offered to take me on as his apprentice. Only now, years on, do I realize the honor that was. Alas, my master perished in a massacre later, slain by racists. Though he taught me everything he knew, I did not manage to complete the guild's requirements for Grand Master while he lived. I know I have no equal in the trade. Yet, uh, until I complete Witcher armor of Grand Master quality, Duke. I shall never be certain I've become my teacher's equal. Thank you, man. Well, this can be a real nasty piece of work, but you're always a class act. Stay strong. J love, thank you. I don't, I don't know about, I don't know about always anything. Thank you. Where do I look for these diagrams? I know of five likely fallen witches, each from a different school: of the wolf, griffin, cat, bear. One from and each. Manticore. How convenient! Every school. Which should I start with? Well, the one that matters, uh, and Manticore. You all want me to get Manticore, right? Wolf is ours, but, um... Manticore? Manticore! School of the Manticore. Probably know the least about it. Though once, long ago, wore some armor forged there. My master said the Manticores have their fortress in the Far East. A century passed, one of their number came to him, a witcher named Merton. He made a poor impression on my master. He stank like a dwarf and still, and uh, quarreled fiercely all the time. Tien Sahil slammed the door in his face and told him to return when he sobered up. He would conduct no business with a drunk. The witcher, however, failed to return. Folk say he got into a booze-fueled brawl with the Ducal Guard. He was arrested and sentenced. Bastoy Prison, where he was held, well, it's been a ruin for years. Still, you may want to start your search there. Okay. Um... I actually have to press him on each of them to get waypoints. Let's at least ask about Wolf and tell me we'll let the rest brother, go for now. Wolf. I came here to sell His goods. Not start another well. quest, but my master liked him. That's what always happens. Him find a safe yet well paid contract. A few years ago, mm. an archaeological expedition arrived in Tucson from Castel Gropia. They questioned my master about the elfin ruins at the Termas. He, he warned them of the danger there and recommended they take Aton as an escort. What kind of danger did he mean? Any idea? Legend claims wraiths haunt the chambers beneath Termas. I cannot say if there is any truth to this, but uh, both Howdy. the scholars and the witcher disappeared without hey. a trace. All right, I don't want to listen to him for six more minutes. Average two per question. He I'd like to ask you about something else. Goes. Like, goodbye. Ah. Yeesh. Farewell. Good Good Jimbo, how are you doing? All right. Gavadurant. Grandmaster. Wolven gear and manticore gear. Inventory and weight issues resolved. That's good. A better stack of food on the bar. Something with 80. Got it. Food we looted at that... Um, fondue. Fondue's 80. The fancy food's at... Pepper. 
you imagine just eating just just pepper? Can you imagine just eating pepper? The answer is no. You should say no. If anyone answered that question, yes. Oh. Can't help you. Handfuls of pepper. Stash. We were going to try and get to our stash. We'll grab Iris because we're going to turn level 37 soon. I want... We got to take this break, this other break. We've only had one, but I need to sort a few things out. What's up, Steel? Good win! Just so much I meant for us to do uh, with merchants to herbalist. We really need to check in at a couple innkeeps. Multiple inns. We need Redanian... Herbal, Mandrake, and Cherry Cordial, and Arenaria. We gotta hit up all these merchants here. We're not quite ready to... Don't crowd around. That fork, the herbalist, should be right down here. They came out of Oxenford Academy with high on the side. Get any broad shouldered lump Beckertick came up. Welcome! Pearls Go. freshly picked, dried, powdered, whatsoever your heart desires. And she Let plays Gwent. She got. She's got some Arenaria. I'll take it all! Since I'm generally so nice to trolls, we are short the cave troll livers that we need. I don't... Does anyone ever sell cave troll liver? Or is it strictly loot? so many things crafted it feels like there aren't too many left they're a bit but we've been doing well but we can't even make white gull a basic witcher ingredient and we are short the alcohol we need to make it And I see that the merchant has things for sale that we are, we don't have a lot of ingredients. I'm doing a bad job at picking up along the way. I'm gonna go ahead and buy them. So long. Make sure we have plenty when we do get around to crafting. Uh, we're going up. We're looking don't for dare to think two different inns. Reginald Aldry has returned, not to be missed. Buy your tickets now, available from me alone. Still waters run deep. So close. Nice tune. Mm. Tune. What is they call you? She looked at Heaven. me all right. Looked right at me. So above us then? That was rude, Geralt. Well, go on. Stroke them. You must be joking. Oh! Stroke we never did come back to get our free when stroke. Friend, him you would find him. <laughs> Good day. My warmest greetings. 
We were promised. This is the touch that was promised. Behold, the famous Reginald. Can't believe I'm actually the doing man this. Is Determination. He must have been brave. Good luck. Truly, I would so have loved to meet him. Ah, a statue like any other. Wow! Oh. A huge chap, nothing extraordinary. But we're we're here for the. Oh, we're here for the inn. Where is the inn? See the mug, right? There they are. If the marker went right to the waypoint, it should show us what level it's on. Struck them. It must be jesting. To stroke a stranger, even if it is just a statue. When as a friend, him you would find. You would fondle a friend, though, yes? The time of day. Around here, it's wine, wine, and more wine. But me, right, no, never I mind. Don't I don't need your stinking innkeep. There's another innkeep. I can go to the other innkeep. Fine. Fine. Alchemy supplies. I bet you the alchemist has some of the alcohol we need, too. Check the alchemist. I think this is the alchemist shop. Lepiotus wheezing wines. A witcher! A Whoa. serious client at last! Tell me, what do you need? Honeysuckle? Ganesha petals? Arenaria. Mandrake and cherry cordial. Redanian herbal. You got Show all that? got in stock. Cherry cordial. Mandrake, cordial. You don't have my Redanian herbal, but I need Redanian. Hey, yeah, I thought that looked like Redanian herbal. Good man. Good man. Mutagen transmuters. Ah, you know what? They're expensive, but where I can't make white gold to make some of the bases like Negredo, Hydrangenum, that one. I dragon them. I dragon them. Three years later, I stopped to read that. Albedo, Aether, and so on. So let's see what I can make, not make. Ow. Good, we can make some white gold, finally. Four. Not a lot. But with four white gold, we can make four of the alchemy bases that we need to make some other things. What do we want to make? don't have the special mutagens we need for those. Relic oil, we're missing cave troll liver. Ogroid oil, cave troll liver. Without cave troll oil, uh, cave troll liver, we're not making those oils. Potions though, maybe? Full moon. Eat trees, filter. And we're short buckthorn. Okay. White Rafford. These are all the potions I don't use. Of course, we need to upgrade them. Upgrade them all. Kibrith. Carrier northern wind. Rebus. Devil's Puffball. I've used that one a little bit. 
Grado, carrier dimeridium. We just max all our bombs. Now that's a thing. Your red, we need three regular red. This here, three regular red. What are we short of? Uh, the other formula for red. There we go. Red. Red. Blue, but I might be able to make a blue from some lesser blues. Two, three, greater blue. I like this. I like where this is going. What are we missing? Didn't work. I needed a regular blue and I turned it into a greater blue. Okay, I wasted that. Blue. Winter cherry. Yeah, winter cherry. Uh, Alchemist does not have winter cherry. The herbalist back down the street. Maybe. It's close. So what I wanted to do was make another greater red. Damn close. We just need one more regular red. Had some transmutation formulas though, didn't he? Lesser, blue to red. Uh, lesser, blue to red. Let's try that. Lesser red. It's winter cherry! Winter cherry. Cherry ring here. Um, greater blue to red. Let's just see if that, I assume that also requires a winter cherry, but I'm going to check. Greater red made from a greater blue. Winter cherry, winter cherry. Herbalist. We're never going to get this break. Uh, the coin uh, is good, yeah. but just between us, I'm going batty with boredom. I know what my customers want before they open their mouths. Bolt men, birch sap. Ladies of all walks, whatever fragrance Duchess Honorietta prefers at the time. If just once somebody would order some poison, eh? Quit complaining. I just bought formulas and I just put a lot of cash in your Need pocket. Keep going. Till next time. Okay. There. An empty stomach. Oh, dreadful. Bringing up the map. Where was that herbalist? Right. Um. Work does one no good. Excuse you. Right, I bring up the map here. Bouncing between NPCs. That herbalist. Back to that herbalist. Southeast. Winter cherry. This is Beauclair, and cherry that is joy. Easy. How do you say that? Hello. Came up. A returning customer is yes. a Winter cherry, please. Yes. And buy. Winter cherry, please. Let me see what you got. Come on. Burmaker, Burmaker. I need winter cherry. That isn't winter cherry. Ecker, warrior. 
auction. Um, Unless we can get three clean lesser reds. We have a bunch of the type ones, enemy type ones, but we're going to need some winter cherry if we want to transmute stuff into reds to, to whip up another greater red. So long. Another greater red. We can swap that out. 20 will become 40. That's her Necker Warrior, so there's no... Uh, we can't use it as a lesser. It has the same value as a lesser, but we can't transmute with it. Alright, I do need that break. My brain is melting. What did I just pick up that brought me back here? Something. Uh, the decoction. We just got a decoction formula. The Necker Warrior decoction. May as well make it. Hmm, you are quite famished. A long journey running through the empty streets. Very much dire need of several items that will keep me strong precisely. Back to Matina Gate. Quick hop up to Corvo Bianco so we can go grab Iris. And that, yeah, that. And then the break. And then the, the extremely overdue break. Lamia is awesome in the kitchen. Uh, truer words were never spoken. Stock center whip await those running riot. Our dodgy values, peace and quiet. And what's bribing? I mean, it hurts. The scavenger hunt is practically where we were. We're running back to town. So much to do. Why would anyone rush through this DLC? I don't understand how people could go through it in 20 hours. Could we spend the first time 30, 40? Something's in the wind. Welcome home, sir. I haven't even been I here yet. I am Barnabas Basil Fauti. By order of the Duchess, I shall serve you as Major Domo. Of Dude, Corbett where'd you Corbett. get the glasses? I previously served with distinction at the Nibli family manor and in Nazaire with Admiral Rompali, who, as you are certain to know, is an extraordinary demanding gentleman. Whoa, Barnabas Basil. Whoa. One thing you ought to know, I'm not your typical landed gentleman. Truth be told, this is the first real property I've ever owned. Oh, in that case, you must leave it all to me. I shall organize, see to everything, and whip the house into order. I dare say this place will soon be the most prosperous vineyard around. Great. Can already see I'm in good hands. Uh, we'll come back and talk to him later. I, I want to get the Thanks. weapons out of the stash. Get back to my business now. See you soon. Barnabas, we'll be back. Stash, stash. I don't remember my way around. Somewhere. Forty-five. We won't be using that for a while. Let's put the eighth in the bank. There's Iris. Well, what do we have here? That joy you must be a new arrival. Welcome aboard. Welcome, welcome. Glad you could join us. Thank you for the follow. Ah, uh, we're putting Geralt's special armor away. 
I... Trophies. Weight problem solved. Still need to sell some junk. Keep forgetting to sell all that junk. All right. So overdue for a break. So go stretch your legs. Smoke them if you got them. Grab a drink. Say that twice. See? I need a break. I'll catch you all in a few. My back aches something horrid. Diddly snaps. See you on the other side. <laughs>